take it to Mars, oh I'll stick like glue inside your mind Just watch me break in your sweat You're falling into me, touch me, I swear What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel, Princess Michelle here If you're tuning in for the first time, I have to say welcome to my channel Happy that you guys are here Today's video is a makeup tutorial for you guys um you guys have requested for me to do more easy looks um different colors and today i decided to do a totally different color that i've ever done here in my channel yellow eyeshadow and i'm not mad at it guys i'm actually loving how this look turned out i am super 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 happy with it i think that i will definitely do it again to go out to go to church or whatnot or for a date night or whatever but i really really excuse my necklace i really enjoyed how this look turned out and it was very easy and along the way i tried some new products that i want to share with you guys today so before we jump into today's video i want to say if you have not yet to subscribe to my channel please consider hitting that subscribe button right down there and follow me on my instagram it's francis 2 sesmichelle that's where you find your girl that is where i am most of the time so if you want to see how i created this look and my thoughts on these new products that i tried then let's go ahead and keep on watching all right guys so today's video i actually tried um two new products that i recently bought and i want to share with you guys really really quick my thoughts on it it's not a review i'm just going to share with you guys my thoughts on it and let you guys know in a future video um how I'm liking it. So the first thing I tried in this video today before we jump into the tutorial is the new uh, LA Girl Pro Matte Foundation. I am a fanatic for their other foundation, the HD uh, Coverage Foundation, and I, I love it. I love matte foundations, and when I saw this one, it was the High Definition Longwear Matte Foundation. I said, yes! Yes, baby, give it to me. So really, really, really quick. The color that I'm using is medium beige, and I am tanned. I did see that it was a little bit lighter than my tan, but I think it's going to work all great whenever I am not tanned. Um, it has a pump, so we are excited about that. Um, it is very matte, guys. Super, super matte. So if you are a dry, 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 dry uh, skin, I don't recommend it. Unless you really, 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 really moisturize your skin before you wear this foundation. It is true to its shade. It is super beautiful. It is super drying. It dries very quick, but I love the coverage. It is for me, it was full coverage. For me, just kind of covered everything on my face and I'm just like, yes, I'm living for it. So as of right now, um, I love this foundation. I love the way it sat on my skin. I loved how it oxidized and I just loved how everything just kind of worked together with the foundation. <laughs> All right, guys, so that's it. Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this voiceover tutorial. Okay, so I'm going to start by prepping my lids with concealer and all i'm doing is putting concealer on my lids and just pretty much blending it with my beauty blender i'm going to go in with the cute af uh, palette by colourpop i'm taking that yellow in the bottom and with the shader brush i'm going to apply it all over my lid and i'm actually packing on like all over my lid then i am grabbing the color which is a little bit on um, more on the burnt orange i'll put all the names on the bottom and i'm using that as my crease transition shade and all i'm doing is actually i take a little time uh actually doing this makeup look because i am going back and forth back and forth making sure that everything is well blended and the colors stand out so all i use were actually these two colors from the palette I just used the yellow on my lid and then that burnt orange on my crease. Then I decided to do a very dramatic wing liner using a using this uh wing uh oh, I'm sorry using this dark black intense black liquid eyeliner by Beauty for Real. Then I pop in some lashes. I'm using the Double Demi Wispy by Ardell. I love how lashes make every look finish and it just looks a bomb. Moving on to face, after moisturizing, I'm moving on to CoverGirl Skin Soothing Primer. Then I'm moving on to the LA Girl Pro Matte Foundation. I did, I did, like I said, pick a color that is a little bit um, lighter than my skin tone, but 
We'll make it work. Then I'm just blending everything with my damp beauty blender. And this foundation is actually pretty cool. Very matte and dries very, very fast. Then I'm moving on to concealer. And I'm using the e.l.f. 16-hour uh, wear cameo concealer from e.l.f. I find this uh, concealer to be very, very inexpensive. And very, 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 very good at hiding and highlighting my under eyes and the high points of my face. So as usual, as normal, we are going to blend, blend, blend everything. And then to set my under eyes, we're going to bake. And I'm using the Collab, um, collab Makeup, I think it's called. Uh, this is the setting, uh, pop, their setting powder. And I'm baking pretty much everywhere. I apply the concealer. Now moving on to uh, what it is, the bronzer and the contour. First, I'm going with the Shade and Line Contour Palette by Kat Von D, taking that middle shade, and I'm um, just contouring my face, bringing a little bit of warmth and definition onto my face, and then I move on to the Fancy Beauty in, sh in I think it's Showbiz Highlight, I'm um, sorry, Bronzer, and with a big fluffy brush, I just bronze my whole face. I love using a powder brush, honestly, because it gives me that bronze uh, effect all over my face. Then I'm moving on to this burnt orange, beautiful terracotta um, blush from Note. And I love the color. I really do. It's very pigmented. A little bit goes a long way. Then I move on to uh, taking out all the baking parts of my face, making sure that everything is very well blended. And then I'm going to move to the bottom part of my eyes, guys. I'd like to do this last. And all I'm doing here, guys, is I'm taking that same yellow color from the ColourPop Cosmetics. And I'm applying it on the bottom of my eyes. That is pretty much all I'm doing just to kind of uh, match everything. Moving on to highlight, I'm using the Artix Couture Illuminati in uh, the highlight. And I'm just highlighting away. I love this highlight. I think it's one of my favorites. Then I'm moving on to mascara just to kind of tie everything together. Tie my lashes with my natural lashes and all that. Then moving on to lips, I'm taking this CoverGirl uh, lip uh, lip pencil and I'm over drawing my lips to make it look like I got some uh, lip injections then I'm using this uh, MAC nude shade by makeup revolution again all the names of everything it will be down below and I am just applying it guys and this just makes the look come together I won't make it easy for you now up my time and i don't really break too easily but i'm worth it cause i'll slip into your dreams tonight oh so give me so give me your all i'll take it i'll take it to mars oh i'll stick like glue inside your mind just watch me break in your sphere you're falling right on the bottom of the comments right sunset so i know you made it to the end of the video <laughs> and as usual there's going to be a giveaway on this video so if you made it to the end you know there's also a giveaway make sure you head on to my instagram account to find out what is the giveaway for this video so if you liked the video do not forget to give this video a thumbs up do not forget to share with your friends and do not forget to follow me on instagram so I hope you subscribe to my channel because that is part of the giveaway. So thank you guys so much for your love. Thank you so much for sticking to the end. Muchos besos. I'll see you ladies on my following video. Adios.